Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to this edition of Weathercast 8. I'm meteorologist Ann Roberts. Okay, so it seems like Mother Nature threw her arsenal at us last week, didn't it? We had flooding. We had severe weather. We even had a tornado warning in the month of July. Well, this week, it seems as if she's going to throw in the kitchen sink for us, or at least the kitchen oven. I'll have more on that in just a bit. Okay, right now, across the nation, you'll notice high pressure is in control almost everywhere. There is that troublesome stationary front off towards the north, but that's not going to affect us any, only our neighbors in Missouri. For us, we're looking at a dome of high pressure that's starting to build today and will only become stronger as the week progresses, bringing high heat index values and high temperatures back into our forecast. Nothing in the general vicinity in terms of rainfall. One little tiny shower in Oklahoma, but all the other activity is up the eastern seaboard. Meaning if you need to mow the lawn today, if you don't mind the heat, then it might be a good day for it. We will not see any cloud cover either, so make sure that you grab lots of sunscreen and water as you head outside for your daily activities, because it is going to be a scorcher. Current dew point temperatures are high across the state. We're seeing mid-70s here in Arkansas, and that's going to, again, make for a very uncomfortable afternoon with very high heat index values. Right now, at noon, the heat index value is in the mid-90s to upper 90s across the entire state. So we're looking at heat index values dancing around 104 to 105 this afternoon, so a very uncomfortable day. Temperatures across the state right now, actual air temperatures anyway, are coming in uncomfortable already as well. We're seeing the hot spot, 92 in Little Rock, and you could say the cool spot on the map is 86 in Russellville, but cool is kind of a relative term when you're in July, right? Here in East End, we're seeing a current temperature of 89 with a heat index value though of 99 degrees already. So be aware of that as you're heading out. Humidity is at 52%. Today we're expecting a high of 95, but that's not the big story. The big story is that heat index for tonight. 77, clear and warm. And for tomorrow, 97. We'll be baking at a heat index of 109. If you're going to the lake, grab the sunscreen and lots of water. It will be a warm one. And also keep in mind your UV index. The cook time for the human body this week is at an 11. You will bake quickly. If you are traveling, the cool spot on the map would be Angel Fire, New Mexico. Otherwise, we're baking at very warm conditions. In your extended forecast, temperatures do not fall back that much, although the heat index values come down just a scotch by Thursday, Friday. Otherwise, we're looking again at very warm, very uncomfortable conditions for this week.